Welcome to Sites. This brief video is just to give you an idea of how to do basic navigation on the Sites website. This page here is called the Home Page. This has general information about what's going on at Sites and events that you might be interested in. You also find links to enrolling and course guides so you can find out more courses as well as the Sites library. We can go into those in more detail later. Another important one is the toolbox. That one is a very important link. We will get to that in another video. Now, to get to a course, you'll notice up at the top we have an option called Select a Course. What I do is I click on that and that lists all the courses that I am currently signed into. I'm going to select one of those courses to go to right now. You might notice the page changes a little bit. Now we are in a specific course home page. You can tell which course it is based on where you selected right up top here. On this page we have links to a lot of other information. Some things are repeated, for example, the Sides Library link, the Course Guide link, and the Toolbox link. You also have news, but you might notice it's a little bit different. This news tends to relate more specifically to your course. There are also three tabs that we want to pay close attention to. The first tab is the Resource tab. When I click on the Resource tab, that gives me access to my content. I'm going to click on that now. This page is the content page. Down the left side you will see links that take you to specific content. On the right it looks exactly the same until you click on one of the links. That will load that specific piece of content that you're trying to look at. You can either continue to the next one by clicking on the link on the left or you can press the next or previous button over here. Both ways allow you to navigate. Now, let's say you're finished with the content and need to get to something else. The fastest way to get there is to click on your course right here at the top and that will take you back to the course homepage. The next tab that you will see is the assessment tab. In the assessment tab you will find the Dropbox, your gradebook, and quizzes. Now a quick look here, the Dropbox provides us a place to put our files, our answers to your assignments. When you do that you will have a single file and you will upload it into this Dropbox. We will go over how to use this at a later point. Now, I can also go in my assessment to see my gradebook. What this will do is it will take me in and show me all the different assignments and what I've completed and how I've scored on them. Finally, there's also a quiz tool. Now, from within the content, you can get links that take you to quizzes directly, or you can go to the quiz tool and then choose from a list of all the possible quizzes. When you're finished with any of these, you can always press the subject and take yourself back to the home page. The last tab is the communication tab. Under the communication tab we have access to chat which opens up a chat room. There's class list. There's the discussion boards. Some courses have questions posted to the students to answer or contribute in an overall class discussion. There's an email and there's a pager tool. All these are available to help you communicate with your classmates and your teacher. I hope this basic navigation has helped. At any point, if you have any questions, please contact us here at SIDES.